What's going on, guys? It's a uh, Friday night. Everyone else is in bed, so I uh, just wanted to do a quick update on what's going on here. Um, so, getting ready to order some plants. Um, really wanting to fill in the background. You know, there's a lot of open space right there, especially in the middle, right behind the, um, you know, right behind the heater, or not behind the heater, but right in front of the heater, right in front of the filter intake. You know, a lot of open space right there. Um, want to get a good plant that'll kind of cover that up. Maybe hide that a little bit. Um, you know, thinking some Ludwigia wrappings um, is what I'm going to put in there. Also, wanting to get some uh, foreground plants, uh, kind of uh, fill in the space up front. So it's not just quite so, you know, just plain uh, blank and open. I'm going to put a couple more Nubius plants, I think, back there, um, right by that uh, driftwood um, behind that one right there. Um, and then I think I'm going to put some, uh, maybe a cardinal plant in here. Um, I think I'm also going to put some uh, pygmy chain sword um, right up front. I think that'll look pretty cool in here. Um, you know, just kind of want to fill things in, get the tank filled in. I'm starting to get some, you know, have some success with the plants, and so I'm getting ready to to just uh, make a big order this next week, make purchase this next week. I'm um, also looking at maybe getting a couple more crypts or something like that. Um, but yeah. So I uh, tell you one thing though that I'm not having some success with though, my cleanup crew. I have been striking out uh, lately with the with the cleanup crew. Um, first I bought a Siamese algae eater, at least what I was told was a Siamese algae eater. And then uh, as it got bigger, I started to realize that um, it was a false Siamensis. So uh, got rid of that thing because as it got bigger, it stopped caring about algae altogether and just uh, really just started um, going after any food that I put in the tank. And um, so kind of annoyed about that. Um, I'm doing some, re some research to make sure it doesn't happen to me again. But um, but yeah, and then also, I told you guys a couple weeks ago, I bought some quarry cats. In fact, hold on, let me show you where they're at right now. Bought some quarry cats. I bought eight of them, but now I am down to three. There's one of them right there. One of those guys. Um, the three that I've gotten that are still there seem to be doing okay, but um, kind of bummed. I've gotten four panda quarries and four Schwartz quarries. I uh, lost all four of the pandas um, and one of the Schwartz quarries right off the bat. The pandas it just seemed like they never really started eating they were just always stressed out um, but you know just really bummed about that I really like quarry cats I really want to get some for this tank um, and just kinda of bummed that I couldn't couldn't keep them alive um, I tried quarry cats before um, but this is back when I was still struggling with you know um, good water parameters and stuff like that I had struggling with ammonia spikes and stuff and still learning quite a bit oh, he just took off I'm still learning quite a bit and didn't really have very good water and so I bought three back then and lost all three of them but uh yeah I really just want to get some I want some quarry cats in here so that's part of the reason why I'm going to get some more plants I want to fill in this front space give them some more cover maybe they'll feel a little bit um, a little bit more uh, comfortable a little bit more at ease instead of just hiding back in that wisteria all the time so uh, but yeah other than that things are going pretty well tank looks good um, it's a little cloudy. I did some maintenance on it today. Did about a 30-40% water change on it and it got a little cloudy after that. Um, that happened earlier this week too. So I don't know if the water company is uh, you know, using a different kind of chemical in there. Has added something. Um, you know, um, or if maybe I've just got a nutrient imbalance in there. But uh, you know, it was cleared up by morning the last time so I imagine by tomorrow morning it'll be nice and clear and back to crystal clear so uh, yeah oh another thing real quick um, let me show you this I got got some new food this week doing some something else other than the uh, tetra flakes um, new life spectrum I've uh, been watching Paducah fish fans channel uh, for a long time now and you know he swears by this stuff so I've tried it out fish seem to like it um, but uh, yeah well, I mean, that's all I got for you guys. You know, have a good weekend. Uh, getting ready to celebrate my daughter's second birthday uh, tomorrow. I'm having a birthday party for her. She actually turned two yesterday, but party's tomorrow. So, uh, excited about that. And, you know, tank's doing well. Have a good weekend, guys. Later.